Welcome to Quick Team Building Activities, where you bring the team, we bring the activities. Today's focus, five low prep and quick icebreaker games for church. In today's video, we're going to focus on some quick activities that you can do at your next church or team building event. Let's get started. As always, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe if you want more content like this. On this channel, we focus on our team building activities for you and your team. Let's have fun. Question of the day. Share some fun team building or church event activities that you've done in the past. Please write your ideas in chat. The first activity, Bible Squeeze Relay. Have participants get into two teams, form a line, and hold hands. Starting with the first person, the team must pass a hand squeeze down the line. When the last person in line gets to squeeze, that person runs to the front of the line and looks up a predetermined verse and reads it out loud to their group. When that person finishes, they start to squeeze and the relay continues. The next activity, as a variation to the Bible squeeze, let's do a variation on this activity. Have participants get into two teams, form a line and hold hands. Starting with the first person, each person must touch the shoulder of the person next to them down the line. When the last person in line gets their shoulder touch, that person runs to the front of the line and looks up a predetermined verse and read it out loud to their group. When that person finishes, they start again until the final person wins. The next activity, photo scavenger hunt. Photo scavenger hunt, you want to make sure that you are dividing into groups of at least three people who have phones. The leader will call out picture categories and the team to locate a photo that matches on their phone must show the judge at the front of the room. Categories can include pictures of feet, someone in a cap and gown, a person on a bike, a family, a dog or a cat, a picture at the beach, picture of food, crazy Christmas clothes, etc. The ideas are endless. The next activity, life verse. Students often choose a verse from the Bible that represents their goals or purpose and call it their life verse. What if that verse was randomly chosen for participants? For fun, of course. Have group members pair up with one person holding a Bible while their partner, without looking, opens it up and points to a random place on the page. We're allowed to see if they got a funny or thoughtful one as this random life verse is shared. The next activity, what's different? Divide into two groups facing each other. Give a set amount of time for team A to observe team B. Have team B leave the room and change something noticeable. They can put something in their back pocket, for example, etc. Team B returns and team A has 30 seconds to find 10 changes. A couple of silly props like a rubber fish sticking out of someone's pocket or a big spider in someone's hair or fun additions to this icebreaker would make it really fun. The next activity, ball of questions. Take a large bouncy ball and in permanent marker write get to know you questions all over it. Toss the ball around and have group members answer the questions on the ball closest to their thumb. Ideas for what you should write on your ball can include things like tell me about a time you got lost or tell me about your favorite vacation. And that's it. Some five low prep and quick icebreaker games for church. Always remember, keep it fun, keep it engaging as you move your team into the future. Happy planning. Lastly, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe if you want more content like this. Remember that you want to make sure that you turn on notifications because we post consistently. Happy planning.